Hi everyone, welcome to the Amazing World YouTube channel. Imagine an indigenous community miles away from the city whose boats are the only source of transportation and livelihood. They have a happy life in their own secret world. You will see traditional houses, dances, wonderful handicrafts, and intricate body painting made with jaguar fruit. The Embora community lives in both Panama and Colombia's Choco areas. Just like their ancestors, their homeland continues to be on the riverbanks. As you can understand, they are nomadic and found in different regions of the country. Embora has a population of approximately 50,000 in Colombia and 33,000 in Panama. The reason for this division began in 1903, when Panama seceded from the Republic of Colombia and attained its independence. Embora people are known for their unique tattoos. Most Embora's have tattooed their bodies entirely with jaguar ink. Both women and men, even the children, practice ink on their bodies and faces. Adults prefer geometric tattoos such as lines and triangles, while children often display tattoos of animals such as a snake or butterfly. Embora uses long bamboo sticks to tattoo their bodies. The tattoo remains on the body for one or two weeks. Embora uses the juice of the unripe jaguar fruit for the ink. Women use essential oils and other substances to turn water into gel used for tattooing. The clothes of the people of Embra are quite colorful. The women wear brightly colored clothes wrapped at the waist as a skirt, except when in towns the women do not cover their torsos and wear long stretched black hair. And finally, they make flower ornaments for their hairs and wear it to complete their look. The women also wear silver necklaces and silver earrings on special occasions. The feature of the necklaces is that most of them are made of silver coins and passed down from mother to daughter. The Embara diet consists of mainly fish and bananas, both found in abundance in river environments. During the 19th century, due to the soil structure of their region, Embara commercially grew coffee, cocoa, rice and sugarcane, and these crops still make up a significant part of their agriculture. Another feature of this community is that they view baskets using black palm leaves. They make sculptures and miniatures from cocoa bolo tree and ivory palm seeds. When you visit their village, you can easily see the masterpieces of the handcrafts. Rivers are indispensable for the people of Embra for food and transportation. That's why many of their houses have been built on the riverbanks since ancient times. These indigenous people built their traditional houses as open-air dwelling raised 6 or 12 feet off the ground on sticks with Dutch roofing. This is probably because they want to protect themselves against wild animals and insects. These houses are typically round in shape and large enough to hold members of an extended family group. The space under the house is used as a dry place to carry out domestic chores or keep animals.
This river lower people have a beautiful feature. This attracts the attention of tourists. Visitors who come to Amber say that people can be happy under any circumstances. Tourists who spend a few days in their village of Amber also say that these people never argue with each other. They are kind, warm and welcoming community. Thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel.